My pin's upside down. No, my pin's upside down. No. <clears throat> The Evil Japan side turning for Milty got uploaded to YouTube. I'll check it out after I go through all of Frosty's stuff. This fucking oh my god! I rewatched this match uh, sometime last week because I was just like, "How did I win this match?" And like, literally, you're gonna see. Okay, you'll just see. Hold on. All right. Oh, button check. As long as uh, the the evil JP vid is not corrupted, I'll I'll, I'll work on it. <laughs> okay. I'm trying to remember who Aki lost to, but Aki's mad strong. I don't think Aki's old school. I think Aki is like part of the newer generation that's been playing. All right. I don't know how I got that 5B. I got lucky. OTG. I don't set a pit for some reason. He can mash. He didn't mash there. Yep. I hold the missile. Dash of 2C. I didn't OTG. I don't know what he tried to do there. He got crossed up, it looks like. Hey, I did the TK ribbon correctly, but I didn't combo. I, I kind of baited the bunker there. Not really. Spent meter all the way into the corner. I didn't want that. I got hit by 5C. Uh... Hey, what up, Sway? What are you doing here, bro? Also, I thought you were following me already. Let's go with that. It was my free entry into Super TSV, bro. I'm not trying to pay 60 bucks. <laughs> yeah, the Zoomer Melty Blood players. 2C? Nope. That match was... That was like that... Uh, that was that reactionary, oh my god, why are you in front of me, mash? <clears throat> oh, you got me? Hey, that's what I like to hear. Um, do I jump here? Yeah, you're not supposed to... That's a hard read. So, like, if you jump, she can air throw you into the bomb. What you're supposed to do is you should just run up and block it. So that way you don't have to deal with the shitty mix up. Or if you're really feeling yourself, you can shield it and shield counter her. Or depending on who you are, you can shield it and do like a DP or something. All right. So this is usually where I like I rob somebody because I'm about to get max meter and have a ton of red HP, but I got hit by 2B. I got hit by 2B so many times this set. Holy shit. <clears throat> do I dump 100 meter here? Because that'd be smart. Air throw? I didn't dash forward far enough to get the air throw. A 4K. I didn't block low for some reason. Which way? I didn't know which way to block that. I got mixed. I got mixed super hard. I didn't tech there because I'm bad. Uh, I should have done DP. Shield? I should have shielded that. I had to burst there if I wanted to live. And then I did air dash back. And he did shield, which was the right response. So I got un I got super unlucky there. Also, I just didn't block for whatever reason. I'm fucking bad. <laughs> Should have been whacked. <laughs> fucking sub to D1, D1 face. Ugh. I don't know. Maybe I just won't enter Melty. I, I could still not enter Melty. I'll, I'll let you know how I feel like. Two weeks before or whatever. Oh, I dash into a jump B. I'm bad. 2C. Which way? I guess right. I didn't. That one you can't punish, I don't think. Which way? That was whack. He could have just backdashed. He would have been fine. Jump 2C. Lucky. Yep, there we go. Finally, I did the thing. Waiting for Aki to move. He doesn't move. He tried to press 2B. He got hit. I didn't air throw him off of that hit. Do I spin meter? Nope. Spin meter. Come on. Wait, why did I H? Uh, 
I didn't want to do that. I wanted to do B Web into 214C, but the arc drive part caught him. So I got lucky. I dropped a combo again. Do I lose this round? Please tell me I lose this for being stupid. Body, uh. I, I didn't mash. I got mixed. I'm pretty sure I'm dead here. I was waiting for that fucking reset the whole time, and then I didn't fucking block it. And I was so mad. I was actually really mad. I was like, you motherfucker. I knew you were going to do that, and I didn't block it. Because if I block it, I punish him, he dies. I didn't set my pit. I'm fucking bad. 2C. I dropped that for some reason. Like, all I do are easy combos, and I still drop those. What the fuck? Damn, I did wake up mash there. I should have died. Yep, there's a 2B. Oh, my God. Which way? I didn't guess correctly. A, 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 A. I don't tech. OTG, that's fine. I tech after that. I probably should have died. I block. Yep. I'm waiting to get my life back. I should have died there. Look how much red life I have. Watch. Like, it's almost even again. Because all I had was red life. Like, there's like three separate times I should have died in this match, and I didn't die yet. Alright, I burned my meter. He got hit by that. That was lucky. I didn't punish the tech. I saw the time, and I was like, I need to kill him now. And for whatever reason, he tried to jump. OT I didn't OTG. I got lucky again. He might have tried to air throw me, and that's, and that's what happened. But there's no reason for me to have been alive there. I should have lost the set already. Like, Spooky said it too. He's like, yo, you were dead, bro. Mm -mm. Shield? Nope. Wow, that was really good for me. Counter hit 5B? Damn, that hit. Throw? Ah, uh, no, nah, he heated. That's fine. Jump, 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 jump. Get out. I didn't press a button on the way down, so landing recovery. Yeah, throw a note. Ah, I didn't shield that. If I shielded that, I would have got a good swing. Uh, I pressed a button on jetpack because I'm bad. I know to block here because I'm about to forget what I said. I dropped a jump to C ender because I'm bad at pressing buttons. I didn't combo that for whatever reason because I'm still bad. Shield, yep. I didn't do the shield counter. I don't know how I got hit by that. I blocked the overhead. I waited too long to press 4C there. Jump. That was the that was actually the best jump I've done in a long time. Except I dropped my combo after. I should have died again. That mash was so lucky. Also listen to Spooky here. Spooky was just like, yo, how is he alive? Like, literally, I died, like, five separate times that last game. I'm supposed to just block there. I don't know why I pressed the button. Whatever. Shield? Nope. Let mech fly at me for free without putting anything in the air. I didn't air dash. I guess I used up my... Yeah, I used up my air dash, so I didn't get to move after. That's me running to jetpacks, because jetpacks are good. Throw? Damn, you pressed a button? Oof. Throw? Yeah, there you go. Pit. I didn't time that correctly. Don't tech. Don't press a button. Blocked the overhead. Didn't mash fast enough. Alright, move. Jump B. Damn, 5B actually anti-aired me. That was, that was good from him. Damn. I just mashed 2C there like a Neanderthal. And he didn't block low. That's weird. I messed this up, right? Oh, no, I didn't mess it up. I didn't need to spend all my meter, but I didn't want him to live through the round. I was just like, fuck it, I'll kill him. Actually, uh, let me look at this again. 
does he die off this? Does he actually die off this if he does the thing he's supposed to do? No, he doesn't. If he wants to live, he mashes heat here. He eats like a thousand damage and he's fine. And he and he probably gets some of his life back. But instead he tried to throw me. When it's like, at this point in the game, I'm just trying to kill you. I don't want you to be alive anymore. Dash up in 2B. That should have hit me. Shield, nope. Shield, nope. I didn't tech for whatever fucking reason. I don't think I could have teched. Throw, yep. Yeah. Back, the back dash is fine there. Uh, 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 uh. I don't do the corner setup because I'm bad. Set pit. Release early, yeah. Release early pit so that way if they mash or jump, it hits them. Uh, Jetpack. He tried to air grab me because he thought I would jump again. Shield? Nope, I didn't shield. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. You do dash up there so that way you just block it. Do I drop this combo? I also do a shitty combo here. That should have done way more, but I was so scared. I don't know why I didn't try to bait the throw, because he definitely was mashing throw there. Damn, he tried to move. I, I really should not have won that match. Really should not have won that match. Alright, Cadenza versus Haley. Alright, this is the last one I'll do before I shut down the stream for today. Alright, Cadenza's pretty good. He, he had, he had like, the longest... I, I hope his character crisis is over. Like, his, his he plays... He plays C... Sisefuku, he plays H Hime, and he also plays F Akiha. I guess he 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 thinks that F Akiha is not a uh, tournament stable, but I guess it's like I feel like she's fine. It's just that she has a lot of hard matchups, whereas Sisefuku is like super stable. So she's just like she gets the hit, she does the combo, she does the set play. Sorry, that's a meme from like forever ago. <laughs> the game at Lightning Mike. EX guard that. There's no reason to let her have that for free. EX guard that too. Thank you. All right. There's a heat. A lot of things. A lot of uh, newer multi player. Uh, one of the things that a lot of newer multi player players don't do is heat in block strings. So like, if someone's trying to create a gap to get you to mash, if you just heat, the heat will hit them anyway. And the heat's not. And you can't block heat. So. You pretty much get your life back. You reset neutral. It's great. But a lot of newer multiple players don't do that shit. Especially if you play Crescent. That shit's free. Everyone just tries to do that shit on wake up. And it's like, nah. Don't actually do it on wake up. Yeah, all the Akias are different enough to where like each of them is interesting. But usually each of them has a set moon that is more or less like the optimal version. So for Seifuku, it's C. For Vermilion, it's F. For regular, it's probably it's most definitely F. It's like VO and block stream would probably but it's better because you get your life back and you stop the clock. So when you VO, I mean when you VO, when you heat, you get you get all your red life back slowly, like you see right now. You stop the clock for however long you have your heat meter, and then you can do it at certain percentages. So if you're crescent, you can do it up to you can heat anytime you have a hundred meter, and you can actually burst if you have max meter when you're getting hit. So max meter works like burst, but you use all your meter to do it. But it's good because like it's not a separate resource for burst. It's literally, hey, did I get to max meter again? I can burst again. I'm good. Ooh, Cadenza. Spin meter. Nice, nice. Good shit, Cadenza. Yeah, Cadets is like one of the better players that I know. Like who actively practices. He's he's pretty good. Like I'm always shocked when he doesn't like make t top eight at any tournament he he goes to. Well, that actually hasn't happened. He's always made top eight, so I don't know what I'm talking about. Actually, no, he didn't make top eight at climax. He was close. I feel like he should have though. He got. I feel like he got robbed. 
Counter hit jump B. I didn't let it. He didn't let the counter hit rock long enough. Counter hit jump B. Ah, I tried to wake up dodge. No dice. <laughs> uni turns leak out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I don't really commentate uni, uh, Melty that often anymore. But I know, I know like an, more than enough about it. Like, I, I don't keep up as much as I used to, but I still retain most of my knowledge. 2C? Nope. Drops the combo. Well, it didn't drop. It's You still get the setup. She just couldn't keep the combo going. Oh, counter hit jump A. Here comes the combo. Uh, 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 uh. Yo, spend your fucking meter. Stop being greedy. Your, your Crescent. Crescent gets meter back so quickly. And even if you spend meter, you're at like 100-something. If you get knocked down, you just... uh, What's it called? Damn. EXDP word? Oh, yeah, yeah. Haley does that. And the thing is, EXDP with uh, with Vermillion is... You know, it's a normal EXDP. It's just that, like, if you read it, you murder her. All right. Knockdown. Are you going to activate the pit? Damn. All right. Cadenza tried to move. So does Cadenza switch or does he stay with his character? Okay, he stayed. Good. That's good. It's 1-1. One, one. Like, the reason why Cadenza lost that one is because there's, like, he's trying to contest at bad times. Like, Vermillion has the superior movement because she has two air dashes. And she's actually just straight up faster. But it's whenever you get the hit, you do significantly more damage. Oh, you don't do more. It's like, it's kind of like 50 50. Like, you hit her, she dies in two combos, she hits you, you. And this moon, you die in like three. If it was F, you die in two straight up. See? That double air dash kind of closes space, but Seifuku kind of just like zooms on the ground. Yep. That's the heat and block stun I was talking about. You just heat there so that way you get the get off me. Spence meter, Spence meter. Now they have no meter. Block, please block this correctly. Get out. So whenever Haley does that setup where they super jump air dash, you can actually just run out of the corner. Like you just need to be attentive. Oh, soko de, soko de. You got a block. You gonna heat? Yep, there it is. See, it's so good. It stops the clock. You get your life back. You set them full screen. Neutral tech. No, Cadenza neutral tech. I don't know why Cadenza didn't neutral tech there. Holy shit. Ah, uh, round's over, rip. Spend meter. He's gonna press buttons. Nope, that's it. Rip. Like, Cadenza's good. It's just like he has those moments where, like, uh,. He, like, second guesses himself too much. Where it's like, yo, the reason why you won game one is because, like, you just did this. Like, you can you contested her in the air pretty well. And you didn't hesitate. But right there, like, sometimes you just have to give up the fact that you can't you can't catch her. Jumpy. Yep. Heat. Get off me. See, even though Cadenza has full HP, he just doesn't want to deal with the mix-up. So it's like, if you don't bait it, then... She, you're full screen again. Hey. Delayed activation there actually kept um, Seifuku in the air long enough so she didn't have to block the uh, heat on the way down. Move. Uh, pressing buttons in the air. You just got to block. Like her, her buttons in the air are so fast, but unless you're willing to preempt of your buttons, then you can't stop her. Overhead. Charge some C. And then Haley didn't block on wake up? What? Wait, did Haley have? No. Uh, this looks like Haley tried to heat. And yeah, it looks like Haley tried to heat and then they got clipped. Because literally, if, if Haley waited two more hits, they would have just been able to mash heat in, in any of those gaps. But instead, just didn't block? That was weird. 
Alright. Gisha Cadenza. Gisha Cadenza. Very good. Alright. 